I got one. She it. White spinner bait. There's bass in here. Nice. It's a little chunk. This is on the trailer hook too, so guess what? They're worth it. Not exactly a, a big fish, but still a fish nonetheless. First catch of the day. Okay, ready? Okay. This is a little white spinner bait that's a combination of a Z-Man chatterbait skirt, a Walmart spinner bait, and a trailer hook from Strike King. It's a really, uh, it's a Frankenstein spinner bait here. But, uh, it just worked, so. That one right by the shore. Oh. That's a good one. All right, let's check this one out. Look at that. Pretty good fish. I think that's a keeper. It's 13 or 14 inches, but I'm not keeping any fish today. This is a Grand Isle Park. It's a disc golf course. So it's quite a bit of water here. And so far I've got two bass out of here, so that's pretty cool. Last week uh, this this park was so flooded that I could not even drive in because the, the entire road was covered in water. And now you can see the water has receded back down to pretty much the regular lake levels. Caught two bass now, both of them on the trailer hook of this spinner bait. So that means they are short striking. Whatever, as long as I catch them. Catch is a catch. Got one, right by the shore. Oh, oh, that was a good one. That was a good one. Spit it. <laughs> On the jump. Never once caught a smallmouth in the river in my life. I would like to. That would be great. What the fuck was that? We saw something jump out of the water. All right, I'm gonna throw a Ned rig into the river and just hope I don't lose it on the first cast. So here we go. Ooh, got one. Ooh, shit. My first ever river smallmouth. Oh shit. Damn, he hit that hard. First ever river smallmouth, finally. Finally, finally, finally. Let's keep trying. Maybe there's more. I guess the old copper truce Ned rig does work in rivers, huh? As they suggest online. Wow. Okay, so this fish has a giant lamprey on it. Am I supposed to leave that thing on there or take it off? Hey, look at this giant, this giant ass parasite hanging out of this fish. Do I leave that on or take it off? I'm not sure, but it's gross. This is a largemouth bass in the river here. So well, thanks for, I'm gonna leave it on there. It's moving around. That's, that's pretty gross. But uh, I, I think some of these things are like not invasive. I don't know. If, <laughs> if I look it up later and it's invasive, I'm sorry. But uh, that's gross.
That's two fish out of the river. Oh, it's a sucker. The fish that keeps jumping out of the water is a sucker. Gross. Ooh, got one. Another smallie. Oh my god, they really do fight. <laughs> this is a little tiny one, but wow. Powerful, powerful fish. Especially in this river, huh? Damn, that thing's got some teeth. Barely even hooked at all whatsoever. Pretty orange eyes, not very red. Let's get a picture of this guy. Let's give this another five or so. If I don't get any more bites here. I meant like a creek. Let's see if there's any fish in this part of the creek. Oh man, there is. Okay, there's one right over here. I see him. Let's see if I can get him to bite. Oh, I got one. Okay. Large mouth. There's a large mouth in this little pool. Look at that. On the copper truce TRD. Finesse TRD. Check it out. I'm just off by a road. Let's see if I can get that homie back in there. Okay. Well, is it possible to get closer down to the creek? Okay, boys, this was a fucking journey. Uh, I've made it to the other side from up there. I was up there, now I'm down here. Now maybe I can catch a fish and land it. Let's see. Head rig first. Got one. Oh boy. Well, that's a good one. Homie does not want to give up. That's a smallie. That's easily my PB Smalley. But can I get him? Check that out. Wow. Glad I came here, huh? That's a PB for sure. Because I have not caught a lot of smallmouth in my life. So let's, uh, let's check this guy out and see how much he is. One pound, 11 ounces, so little, that's a one pound, 11 ounces, little under uh, 1.75, so let's get a, a length. That's a 15er, that is a keeper. Let's let him go. Okay, I've gone from uh, Never once catching a smallmouth bass to catching three in one day. A lot of a river anyway. Got one. Oh, wow. It's a good largey. It's a good largey. My God. Gotta tire this guy out before I get him out of the water. Oh my god. This might be a PB largey. Oh my god. 
Okay, he's hooked pretty bad, so I'm gonna have to try to do some surgery real quick. Okay. No blood. This might be the biggest, biggest bass I've ever caught. Oh my God, check him out. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Wow. Let's give him a little measurement here. Three pounds, one ounce. New PB, boys. New PB. Let's see how long he is. 17 and a half inches. 17 and a half inch, three pounder. 17 and a half inch, three pounder. Wow. Ned Rig doesn't only catch small fish, huh? That you probably wouldn't have believed that from my last video. Thanks for biting, buddy. Let's let you go. Wow, there's some big fish in here, huh? It's two, two PBs, one, one video. Bent my hook out a little bit. That's no good. <laughs> no good. Did not expect this to happen today. It's pretty nice. I didn't take a freaking picture of him. God damn it. Oh my God. This is the new record for the smallest fish I've ever caught. This is it. This is it guys. That's a good fish. Wow. Biggest fish I've caught and smallest fish I've caught in the same video, guys. That's pretty dope. Well, I uh, caught the biggest largemouth bass I've ever caught, and I caught the biggest smallmouth bass I've ever caught in the same day. So two new personal bests. Then I went and caught that uh, tiny green sunfish. So I caught the smallest fish I've ever caught. Biggest and smallest, same day. Thanks for watching. Please uh, like, comment, subscribe, tell your friends. Turn on post notifications, whatever. I don't know. See ya. Get it. Fish in the lake, gonna catch them all. Got my gamer glow.